Hello everybody, this is Jeff at eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a look at this Gen Y Hitch shock absorbing fifth wheel pin box for your Lippert 1116 and Lippert 1716 pin boxes. And this pin box has a 30,000 pound weight capacity. Now this fifth wheel king pin box is an upgrade to your existing Lippert 1116 or Lippert 1716 pin box that's on your fifth wheel trailer. This pin box will replace the factory pin box on the trailer and the king pin right down here is what will insert into your truck's fifth wheel hitch. Now this pin box uses a nice shock absorbing design which ensures a nice smooth steady ride and the technology in this will function just like a torsion axle and it limits the transfer of road shock from the trailer to the truck and vice versa. I want to show you an insert of what the insides are made of this right here where these bolts are. You can see those tubes we mentioned they have the design of a torsion axle so they have an outer tube with rubber cords around the inner bar and those will help reduce chucking and rough fore and aft motion and it'll also limit bounce and jarring up and down motion. What's nice about this pin box is there's no airbags that you have to maintain and then they, you do use fewer moving parts to repair or replace them with some of your other shock absorbing solutions. This does also offer a unique pin weight scale on one of the lower arms right here. And that scale is built in to help you balance your trailer. The scale lets you know your load needs to be adjusted before you tow. And the vertical load or pin weight on the trailer refers to the weight that a fully loaded trailer is going to exert downward on your hitch in the truck bed. And too little vertical load can cause trailer sway. Too much load could cause poor performance. So I just wanted to zoom in here and show you. As you can see, the scale right here on this lower arm. So if you look at that scale, it has a red area on top and then a red area right down here on the bottom. So on top there's red and the bottom there's red. And that's the maximum load at the top, the minimum load at the bottom, and there's a green area in the middle. So the red areas are too high and too low areas. You do not want to be in that area. You want to be in the green area. The maximum red up at the top, that scale indicates your maximum vertical load of 4,500 pounds. The very bottom, that red area is going to tell you there's no vertical load at zero pounds. So you want this white marker over here, this white indicator line, to be in the green area once you're all hooked up and loaded down. That green area will give you a pin weight capacity range of 2,000 to 4,500 pounds. And you do need at least 2,000 pound load, vertical load, for this built-in shock absorption system to function effectively. So basically, as we mentioned, that line there should be pointing inside that green area. Now this is a nice heavy-duty steel construction. has a real nice powder coat finish on it to resist wear and corrosion. And to install this, it's a very simple bolt-on installation. The mounting holes on this pin box will line up with the factory holes. And they do mount using these included filler shims and the factory or the existing factory bolts. And the reason they include these shims is because the width on this pin box, on these wings back here, is 12 inches. And to fit it onto the Lippert 1116 and Lippert 1716, they are 12 and a half inches wide. So you do need to install the plates so they'll fit in there correctly. <clears throat> Now these parts are made in the USA, and again the towing capacity on this is 30,000 pounds. But that should do it for the review on the Gen Y Hitch shock absorbing fifth wheel pin box for the Lippert 1116 and the Lippert 1716 pin boxes.